Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another try on haul. Today's try on haul is going to be Kohl's. I just picked up a ton of new items and I'm super excited to share them with you guys today. I think a lot of them are really good like at home holiday options. So if you're doing like little family parties or anything like that or you just kind of want to like still feel festive just staying at home with your family, I think you guys might really enjoy some of these pieces. As always, my sizing and all of the links will be down below for you guys. Um, bear with me. We have the baby here with me who has not let me put her down for like three hours straight. So I'm going to try to make this work. She seems content right now. So with all of that said, let's jump right in. Okay, so first up is this like Sherpa sweater type thing. This is by Vera Wang. I feel like she always comes out with some variation of this. Um, I have one from like a couple years ago that's just like a v-neck sweatshirt in this same exact material and I love it. So up close you guys can see it's like super duper soft and has like really nice texture to it. I do like the line detail kind of going on in this like faux tulip hem so it doesn't actually like separate and it's in this like grayish beige creamy white color. Like it's almost colorless. I don't even know how to describe it. It definitely looks a lot more white in the viewfinder, but it's like a grayish, a very, very light grayish. I love that the strings are almost like a matte ribbon, and then they have like the little thing at the bottom. It just makes it look a little more sporty, and it does have a hood as well. I got mine in a size small. I'm not going to be mentioning the prices of anything just because they vary so much at Kohl's, um, but I never spend full price on literally like anything there. I paired this with my Nine West faux leather leggings. These are my favorite. I featured these in my last Kohl's haul. So yeah, absolutely love these. I have these in an extra small and then I just threw on my blowfish sneakers to finish off the look. Just super cozy and this sweater is so warm. <laughs> so, so warm. It feels like you're wearing a blanket. It's amazing. All right guys, next up I have this plaid which I actually love. So I've shared almost this exact outfit before. I think it was in like my old Navy haul or something. I just have my Nine West um, full leather leggings on again with my sneakers. I have this always stylish mama rock and roll t-shirt on and this is in a size medium in case you're interested. I did size up in that so that's why it's a little bit longer. But this plaid is from Kohl's by the brand Champs um, and I don't normally shop that brand but I saw this and it has a zipper instead of buttons which I thought was really really cool and now that I have it on like it's super duper soft it's the perfect weight it's not thin and it's not thick but it's very very soft very comfortable and it's like super flattering from the side like it's not like a big and boxy but it's nice and long so it covers your bum I just feel like this is like the perfect plaid top um, and like I said I think it's really cool that it has a zipper but they had this in a couple of different colors it feels like really really good quality so highly recommend this one if you are in the market for a new plaid shirt and in case you're wondering what it looked like zipped up like if you didn't have a t-shirt on underneath you could just wear it as is if you wanted to um, and just like unzip it a little bit at the top but yeah I just wanted to show you guys what it looked like zipped okay next up guys I have this like long sleeve t-shirt dress almost it's just like a sheath dress with a little tie belt. Honestly, it just feels like you're wearing a big like t-shirt, um, but the tie makes this dress so flattering and so cute. I love the little like bubble sleeve that it has. And yeah, it's just very simple, a good piece to have in your closet. I feel like you could really dress this up. I have it paired with just some black tights and my black croc booties from Walmart. You could definitely throw on some pumps or you could even throw on like some liquid leggings and sneakers if you wanted to make it casual with like a little um, jacket over the top. This is just something great to have in your closet. But what a perfect like at home little like Christmas party dress. It definitely makes you feel a little more dressed up because you are wearing like, you know, a cute little dress. So yeah, they had this in black as well and they may have had another color. I'm not sure. The black was really pretty but I really liked the gray and I liked that I felt like I could wear this with, like I said, sneakers or something like that too. So. And I got mine in a size small, so I would definitely say true to size. Next up, I have this really fun mini dress. So I definitely think I could have probably gotten my true size, but I got a medium just because it looked so small on the hanger. But let me show you close up. It's got this like clustered floral print on it, very much like a fall um, colored print. I paired it with a long necklace just because I felt like it looked cute like that. And then I have on my black tights and then these brown booties from Target. This is definitely more of like a casual way to wear it. I actually think it would probably look better without black tights. 
um, just with the brown booties and like a jacket or something if you could get away with that um, but I do think it looks really cute with the tights as well and it's a very soft like thin stretchy material that actually probably work as like a little maternity dress as well and probably be really cute but yeah like I said I think I could have gotten my size small but the medium actually works as well and I love the tiered skirt and I do have a jacket that I wanted to try on with it so let me go put that on okay so I grabbed this jacket to go with this dress and I actually think this is adorable I really really love it this jacket is by the Lauren Conrad line at Kohl's which I generally really like this jacket is really nice it's like soft it's not too heavy it's not too thin it's got that really nice Sherpa um, like texture and feel to it and then on the inside it has like a nice lining I like that this is like a moto jacket uh, it's just a little bit different than your average Sherpa jacket that you would see but definitely trendy super cute I got mine in extra small um, and I feel like it fits me perfectly and yeah, I think this is actually a really cute combo. Next up, guys, I have this tank and sweater combo paired with these SO jeans, which I will get to. But let's start with this sweater. So up close, it's like a black and white kind of mixed um, knit. It's adorable. I love this sleeve. You guys are probably sick of hearing me say I love this sleeve or I love the bubble sleeve, but I just really like that trend. It takes any like regular item of clothing to like the next level, I guess. This sweater isn't... The softest thing ever but it's not like itchy if that makes sense I definitely can get away with wearing a tank under it but it's not like the softest sweater I don't really know how to describe it if you're very very sensitive to knits and stuff you may want to wear like a long sleeve under this one so moving on to this tank top it's like a satin material um, I got mine in an extra small I just have my bra straps tucked in by the way so I I still have a bra on um, but it has this really pretty lace like v-neck detail. I've seen this everywhere. It does have a racer back. It also has adjustable straps, which is amazing on a tank like this. I feel like this tank top is very sexy. I love the way it fits. Um, like I said, I got mine in an extra small and it's very, very comfortable, good quality. I have it front tucked into my jeans. You could do so many things with this and it's definitely great like year round. Moving on to these jeans. So these are the SO Curvy Jeans. I mentioned these in my last Kohl's try on, but I'm obsessed with these. These are so comfortable, they fit so well. If you have a problem with jeans not being like tight enough in your waist, I highly, highly recommend checking out the Curvy Jeggings, the SO Curvy Jeggings. They are so good. I got my true size one um, for a 25 inch waist and they fit me perfectly. They are not going to budge on my waist. Like they are nice and snug just the way I like them, but then they're not too tight like in my leg and butt area. Really, really love these. They are super duper affordable and they have um, a couple different washes and they have some with distressing and everything. I just have mine rolled a little bit at the bottom with my Walmart booties again, but yeah, I really love this outfit. This is something that you could wear too, like working from home or something like that. Like if you're doing um, video calls or whatever, it's like really pretty and kind of formal looking up here, but then you're just in like, you know, jeans and a big sweater. So yeah, by the way, this sweater does not have pockets. I keep like wanting to put my hand in a pocket, but it doesn't have them. That is this outfit. So I quickly just wanted to show you guys this tank untucked. It comes like right there. Um, but yeah, again, it's even flattering, like untucked. I love the little um, slit in the side. So if you want a cozy sweater, cozy and soft, this is the sweater for you. I got this in a size small. It is very, very oversized, but in like a good way, a very intentional way. It's in this very unique, like taupey brown kind of shade. I love this asymmetrical thing going on in the front. You could definitely get away with this with leggings because it is a bit longer uh, unless you're really tall but this is just super super soft and cozy and it's a little bit like unique but classic at the same time I just still have on my SO curvy jeans and then I paired it with these tote booties from Walmart but I think this would actually look really cute with high boots I just don't have the right color mine were kind of like clashing with this taupe shade I also love the change in like the knit texture so you have like a ribbing here then you have like crocheted knit is that what it's called uh, I don't remember and then just like a plain one here and this does actually open and overlap but yeah I really love this I think it's really cute and timeless okay guys I am obsessed with this sweater this is by Lauren Conrad it's in like a blush pink color even though it's showing up 
um, kind of cream. It is like a really pretty blush. It has all of this detailing and all of this like eyelash kind of texture going on. It's just really, really pretty. It looks really expensive because of like all the details going on. Um, I love that it's like a basic sweater, but then it has, you know, the balloon sleeve and that different texture to it to really make it look a little bit more trendy. It comes like mid bum, like just across my bum. I almost want to swap mine out for a medium. I got mine actually... So I guess this one's an extra small, so maybe I'll just go with the small. I think I want it to be a little bit more like oversized. Um, I don't know, let me know what you guys think in the comments. But they had this in a couple different colors. I just paired it again with my SO Curvy Jeans and my Taupe Booties. But yeah, I think this makes a really cute, kind of classic outfit. Um, and the sweater is super duper soft too, like not itchy whatsoever. So this is what it looks like untucked. It's really cute like that as well. If you are not someone who likes to front tuck your like sweaters and stuff. So yeah, I really, really love this. All right guys, so I have a different color for you. I really wanted to buy this in cream or gray, but I resisted and I got it in a different color. So it's definitely showing up a little more purpley on camera, but it is like a dark purplish burgundy color. They had this in a couple different colors. They had gray cream, um, and then they had a couple multicolored ones and they had an emerald green one, which is the one I almost got. But I don't have this tucked or anything. It's just kind of like rolled under. Like this is how it looks untucked. Like it's kind of fitted at the bottom. So you could also wear it just like this. I like mine just kind of like, I don't know, pulled up a little bit. So it almost looks tucked in but is not. This sweater is super soft, very, very comfortable, and it is super duper flattering. It really kind of shows off your waist because it's more fitted down here and the sleeves really nice and fun. I love the ribbed texture on it. Um, like I said, they had a bunch of different colors, so if this is not your jam, you could get the cream or the gray. The gray was beautiful. I just do not need another gray sweater in my closet, so I opted for the purple, something a little different. I have it paired with my SO curvy jeans and my Walmart lace-up taupe booties. Very cute. All right, guys, this is one of those items I didn't expect to like as much as I do. So just for time's sake, I kept the same jeans on in the taupe booties. I think this does work, but you could also do like black jeans and like a dressier uh, black boot or something. But this is like a waffle knit with a metallic thread in it, and it's really cute. They also had this in like a mint green, which was kind of different and pretty for this time of year. And it had the uh, metallic thread in it as well. I got mine in a size small, and this is by the Lauren Conrad brand. I love this like tiered detailing. It kind of has this like unfinished hem down here as well, just like adding some extra texture. But this is really, really cute. I feel like you could even get away with this like with some leggings and sneakers and like a little jacket or something. But again, a really nice holiday option where it just feels like a t-shirt but it looks a little bit dressier and it definitely has that like little bit of sparkle which makes it fun and very holiday-esque. I think this is really adorable. I actually really like it. I feel like you could totally go with like a rocker vibe on this too with like a black leather jacket, some dark skinny jeans, and some black like um, knee-high boots or something. Okay guys, for this last look I wanted to go with something super duper cozy. So I'm like cozy Sherpa pretty much from head to toe other than my pants. Starting at the top, I have this Sherpa on. This is again by the Champs brand and this was actually like um, displayed right over by the plaid shirts. So when I saw this, I was like, oh my gosh, that is really fun. Um, it's definitely oversized. I got a small, um, but I love that it has this like subtle bat wing kind of thing going on and like the shape of this. It's just like different than your average Sherpa. It does have the half zip here. Um, and it's super duper soft. I also love the pink that is added into this like basic buffalo plaid. I think that makes it so different and unique and just kind of like fun. Okay, so I just realized that this has a pocket that goes all the way through and it's super like nice inside. It's got like a nice jersey inside. I'm obsessed with this. I think this is so, so cute. Like I said, it is oversized. I even feel like you could size down if you don't want it so big, but I really like that look, especially with a Sherpa. I just feel like it works. And this isn't like overly thick, but it's not super thin either. Like I feel like it's the perfect weight. So yeah, this one is definitely staying in my closet. I really love it. Um, I paired it with my Levi's that I mentioned in my last Kohl's haul. I love these Levi's. They fit me perfectly. And like I said about them before, sometimes a good pair of jeans is just worth the price. So yes, I absolutely love these. And then on bottom, I have these really fun um, lace-up booties from Kohl's, and I will give you guys a close-up. So here is a close-up on those. Um, the color isn't showing up 
as pretty as it is in person. It's showing up a little bit darker on camera, but I love this like Sherpa detail here and like the gold um, accents and everything. They're super duper comfortable. Um, I highly recommend getting a half size up. Um, and even a whole size if you want to wear like big fuzzy socks. I originally tried on my normal seven and a half and they were so snug tight even with just like a plain ankle sock. So um, I ended up getting the size eights, but yeah, I love them. I think they are super duper cute. I also think that they look and feel very expensive. So that is the last look guys. Okay guys, that is absolutely it for today's haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm sorry if you felt like it was rushed. I definitely feel like I was rushing this one. I know you guys can't tell, but it is like almost dark outside. I have my camera set to like the highest exposure, so it probably got a little grainy there at the end. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys are all doing well. I love you so much, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.